Hey guys, welcome to day 85 of playing Persona 4 Golden in real time. The series where I play through Persona 4 Golden one day at a time on the same date as in the game. So, today is July, the 4th of July, so let's go ahead and see what the gang is up to today. Now, I will say, with the game taking place in Japan, I don't quite think they're going to be celebrating Independence Day, but we'll see. That's it for Pascal. Did you get all that in your notes? Your brains aren't smart enough to retain this just by listening. Make sure you write all this down for later review. Especially, man is but a reed. The most feeble thing is nature, but he is a thinking reed. That's incredibly important. Hey, are you paying attention, Yosuke Hanamura? I doubt you have many deep thoughts going on in your daily life. Who said this? Man is but a reed. The most feeble thing in nature, but he is a thinking reed. Ah, oh, crap. I was spacing out, and he totally caught me. You, you. You gotta help me. I mean, it was pretty clear he just said Pascal, so... You gave him the answer you think is correct. Oh, I see that what you did pick up... I see that you did pick up on something I was saying while sitting there with that stupid look at your on your face. Man is better read, but he's a thinking read. Came from the mind of Blaise Pascal. Write that down. Alright, so if man is a thinking read, do you know what an unthinking read is? An unthinking read is just a read, so I expect you to at least keep thinking, and read some books. Oh, uh, thank god you. I don't know what he would have said if I'd given the wrong answer. Yosuke appreciates you. At least someone does. You feel you've become a lone closer to Yosuke. Your expression has increased. Alright, the usual host class invites. You. If you can spare the time, can you s come somewhere with me? No rush or anything. Later. Yosuke looks like he's in English. Maybe you should hang out with Yosuke after school. I'll think about it. Oh, hey, Yusan. Do you have some free time today? Well, if you do, and you feel like hanging out, I'll be around the liquor store. Maybe you should hang out with Naoki after school. Okay, I, I didn't realize today was like a full lineup. Oh, sorry. I'm just kind of tired. Right, right. Practice today, too. I'll see you later. Yumi seems to be acting strangely. Maybe we should attend drama club practice after school today. Classes have ended for today. You are waiting for Rize to recover. So, let's go ahead and continue searching for that dog. So we're gonna go to the Samigawa floodplain. Let's see if... It, there he is. It seems that the dog is still wary of you. What should you do? Let's talk to it gently again. It seemed to work last time. It seems the dog became less wary of you. The dog ran away. We should look for it on another day. So, let's go ahead and go into town. And then go to the north part of the shopping district. And right here, it's Saozai Dekaku. Welcome! Our food is freshly made and tastes incredibly great. What do you want to buy? Let's go ahead and buy a steak skewer. Our steak skewer is 320 yen. This is our signature dish here. It tastes the best. We currently have... A lot of a lot more than the Roja 20 yen. Buy a steak skewer? Why not? Thank you. Have a nice day. Purchase steak skewer. Now let's go ahead and go. Let's go to Juness, I think. Or actually, I think we have to go to school. All right. Where is he? There he is. Let's go ahead, take up Yosuke on that invitation. Yo! Can I talk to you for a minute? There's something I want to say. Yosuke seems tormented. Since you have Pixie, if we're still in the Magician Arcana, you feel you could be closer. You feel your relationship with Yosuke is going to become closer soon. Will we spend the afternoon with Yosuke? I see. Thanks, man. <laughs> Yosuke looks happy. Samigawa Riverbank. You wandered here with a pensive Yosuke. Yosuke is holding something. I found this. It's a print club sticker I took with Saki Senpai. When I first got here, she insisted on taking it. 
Back then, somewhere inside me, I thought I was above this place. A lot of people saw me as the enemy because Juness was going to ruin the shopping district. But when I met her, she told me, Parents are parents. You're you. No, I'm you. Even if she didn't really mean it, it made me happy. Because of her, I started to think maybe this town wasn't all that bad. But then... I mean, I feel like she died is a little harsh, but I don't think she dumped him because I don't think they ever dated, but... I guess we'll go with this one. Why? Why did she have to die? It ticks me off. It makes me mad. I wanted to talk with her more. I wanted to get to know her better, but... Yosuke is sobbing out loud. Oh my. I guess that's how the... Before he was here, he just called the river bed, not the Samigawa floodplain. You, I get it now. I want to forget about Saki Senpai, how she's not here anymore. I want to forget that. I was living a boring life in the middle of nowhere. When the murder started, I got excited. Ooh, is he confessing? I thought there was finally a point to me being an Inaba. I thought I could forget Senpai was gone and the fact that I was such a loser. I jumped at the murders and never once thought about what I was doing. I didn't even take the first step. I'm sorry, Saki Senpai. I'm sorry, you. Okay, I feel like all of these, they're kind of, none of them are like, yeah, that's a great response. Let's go ahead and say, just take it slow, you know, take it easy. Yeah, Yosuke nodded with the red eyes. But I think I'm awake now. I need to get over the fact that Saki Senpai isn't coming back. That when this case ends, I'll have nowhere to run. And I don't ha and I won't have changed. You make me realize that. It seems you were able to act as Yosuke's crutch. You feel a bond between you and Yosuke. Alright, another rank. I'll take it. The Yosuke Hanamura Social Link has reached level 8. The power to create personas that the Magician Arcana has grown. Yosuke's growth of heart has affected his persona as well. Okay, Diorama. So, moderate. Okay, another healing ability. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Let's go ahead and just upgrade Dia then. So, yep, forget that. You spend a while with Yosuke and walked him home. All right, let's go ahead and save. And then let's go hit the streets for something to hang out with. So shopping district, there's a Dachi. Oh. It's you, what are you doing out so late? I'm doing overtime. And yeah, I think we've read this enough. So let's go ahead and see if anyone else is out. There's that guy, but it doesn't look like we're gonna really hit it off. Oh, Kanji, yep, that's a pretty good one. Let's hang out with him for the night. What you doing? Yo, whoa, you senpai. What are you doing out at this time of night? I'm just enjoying the night breeze. It's getting a little too hot inside. Hey, if you want, we could chat a bit. Kanji seems bored. You might appreciate it if you talked with him. Will you spend the evening with Kanji? Yeah, of course. Yeah. Kanji seems happy. Uh... Exams are coming up soon. Dang finals. What's the point of studying anyway? It ain't like I'm gonna use classical lit and quadratic equations in the textile shop. The only thing a real man needs is a burning red body handed down from his parents. Yeah, I'm kind of confused by that. Burning red body? But I mean, honestly, let's go ahead and agree with him. Let's, let's see where he goes if we encourage him. <laughs> right? Huh. Now that's my senpai. Uh. Nah, that doesn't seem right. I feel like what I said didn't make no sense. Kanji seems to have reconsidered. Now ain't the time to whine about it. I gotta at least keep from being held back. You enjoyed your idle chat with Kanji. You feel your relationship with Kanji has grown stronger. You feel your relate. Oh. I thought it changed. Whoa. Dang, look at the time. Sorry for keeping you out here with me. Oh yeah, you want some of this? I can't get enough of this stuff. Don't you received white Karinto from Kanji. Well, catch you later. Night. You part with Kanji and go home.
All right, so that's going to wrap up the gameplay for today and bring us on to shuffle time. So let's go ahead and see what today's card is. It's going to be the Four of Pentacles. So let's go ahead. Let me get into focus. There we go. So let's see what that means fate has in store for us today. The Four of Pentacles card is capable of generating both negative and positive perceptions. On one hand, the card signifies that you have successfully managed to accomplish much of your goals and you have managed to attain a significant material wealth in the process. However, on the other hand, there's a significant chance that you'll start valuing things only for their material worth. You have worked hard to get to the point where you are now, and it's absolutely natural for your desire to make sure that you remain stable. But this also has a chance to turn you into an overly possessive or greedy person who wants to ensure that no one is capable of taking away your own wealth. The Four of Pentacles is also a card which shows that you are currently in a position in which you have solid investments and that you are financially stable. Because of your newfound wealth, you are being particularly conservative about money, and you are most definitely not include, inclined to gamble when it comes to any kind of financial matters. You are protective of what you have managed to accumulate throughout time, and you desire to steadily increase your overall net worth. Your overall net worth. Be aware that without risk, there is no reward. If you spend too much of your time attempting to conserve, you may become a prisoner to own to your own material possessions. Wealth is a kind of energy as well, and we create what we express. Okay. So, sounds like definitely a bit of a mixed one. That's like, hey, you have a lot of money, but you're gonna kind of holding on to money too much. Which, honestly, I don't think that's too much of an issue You're, like recently. I think it's spending too much is definitely the bigger issue, but, you know... I guess I guess I'm the victim of the card that, you know, I'm still advocating for holding on to money. But either way, uh, I guess it's a little ironic. Well, Fourth of July, Four of Pentacles, kind of close, but not really. And you know, Independence Day, and it's talking about being constrained by money. So I feel like this one didn't really sync up with the holiday, but who knows? Either way, that's another day done. Another card down. So thank you guys for watching and have a happy 4th of July. I'll see you guys tomorrow.